On game days, Caleb Ewells is known as a staple in the Mississippi State defense. The senior defensive lineman has racked up 84 tackles and has started in every single game of his career. But when he isn't on the football field, Caleb can only be found in one place, under the hood of a car. It first started, you know, just seeing my uncle kind of, you know, working on cars and helping everyone out. So he kind of worked at shops and everything, and he kind of knew a lot of people around the neighborhood that know that he does a great job with cars. So that kind of sparked my interest to see, like, uh, what does he do and how does he do it. As I grew up seeing him, you know, it was kind of interesting, like, uh, why this part is so important. You know, everybody sees the motor, they know about the motor and the transmission. But me, I wanted to get more in detail, like why is this part so important that you know the car can't run or why it can't move. Caleb learned quickly. Soon, he was able to work without his uncle's watchful eye. I felt like I kind of knew what I was doing when he uh, trusted me, you know, to do some of the things that he asked me to do and also be a part of some of the big bills and some of the big uh, activities that he had. I most definitely started on my own when I owned my first car, you know, knowing that it had a lot of problems and uh, kind of just doing about what I learned and what I saw it just kind of helped me out. Now at Mississippi State, Caleb has been designated the car expert and often helps his teammates whenever they have any car trouble. If they have any problems with anything, they always, they always contact me like my opinion, like what do I think it is or anything like that. So. Before they go to a local shop or anything or willing to spend a lot of money, I think they'll contact me first. Well, my car was running hot one day, and he was like, well, PJ, you check your antifreeze? I was like, antifreeze? And uh, I didn't even know what antifreeze was, to tell you the truth. <laughs> so he opened up my hood, and yeah, sure enough, my antifreeze was running low. So we went to um, AutoZone or whatever, we got some antifreeze and put that in there. And my air conditioner had ran out too. He got some Freon for me, put that in there, and said, I ain't know nothing about that. Uh, that car might not start, it might be, you know, dead batteries or tires are flat or uh, oil change, anything of that nature. Uh, fix a couple of people's spares. He's really good at that because they're like NASCAR basically. So if he don't know something, he'll figure it out soon though. So it ain't going to take him long not to figure it out. I don't mind helping those guys at all at any time that they need it. For Caleb, the reason to work on cars now is the same as it was when he was young. The thing that excitement, excitement is about it, like, you know, like, growing up, I always wonder, you know, like, um, you know, something that people use every day, you know, and all the components and the parts and the, the time that goes into it, the ingenuity that goes into it, it just makes me wonder, like, you know, why is this part so important, you know? Uh, why is it that when it first came out, uh, why was it that, you know, it was just so important and uh, what made it to be what it is. Just like with cars, Caleb takes that curiosity to other parts of his life. Just like a car, why this part fit is just like myself, you know, where do I fit, you know, in, you know, part of life, you know, uh, and in positive ways, you know, where do I fit? I'm a great role model, great husband, you know, great person. After almost four years of starting, Caleb will remember one thing, how proud he is to be a Bulldog. I will look back, you know, say it would be, uh, it was a great honor, especially to start from my freshman year until now I'm playing more than uh, 40 plus consecutive games. You know, I feel like, you know, that's a great honor and to me that would be something that would be very special. You can achieve, you know, anything that you put your mind to and don't let anybody tell you anything otherwise.